Ikuzo Mamazaha. Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Samurai Showdown RPG. It's been a little while for us. We had a, a couple little breaks there. The uh, yeah, Mr. Mysterious GG, he's Zerfall, and it has been a, a while. Yeah, we had like a, a. It's been a while. No, there's a big old uh, charity stream that's happened since the last time we recorded this game, and yeah, <laughs> the main our main goal is donations to get are the hell still open. Game. Donations are still open. Link in bio. Um. Oh Please yeah, we're seeing uh, we're seeing the the headless guys again here. Well, the last time I remember seeing them, we were shrunk and got our butts kicked, and then it was like a gimmick thing where we had to like fight them. We had to just avoid them, fight the boss that meant that we weren't shrunk, and then everything was fine. Yeah, it was weird too because they're they're pretty strong, but they're not. Um... Like, their hit points aren't that high. They just have really high defense. Yeah. Due to the lack of bodies, I guess. Yeah, there's nothing to hurt. They're like, um... Uh, and it's not what? metal slime. Whoa, nobody got hit with that shit. Wow. Hollow one attacks. That's a good name for that character. <laughs> it actually is, yeah. I mean, it's not metal slime rules. It's not like they've got five hit points, but everything you do rounds up to one damage. No. I was kind of hoping he was going to get, uh... Oh, this is the bad one. That's not as bad as it used to be. Yeah, it's still more damage than you seem to be able to do to them. As far as a percentage of hit points. Oh, right, that's, uh... Pack up or something? Defense up, maybe? Spring King oh, there Fisher we go. Slash. Yeah, both of them. Or they can all get it out of the way. Oh, okay, you got him. Moan. Yeah, Moan doesn't seem to be as threatening. I powered him up, though. Alright, see if you can hit something this time, big hero. Just one of them. Jeez. Homeru, is there an accuracy score we need to level up for you, Homeru? Main character, man? There we go. We got one of them out of the way. Yeah, the moans are the least threatening by far, though. You got Hollow One here close to defeated, but he's he's been hanging around for a while. Yep. There we go. Oh, you got a cool death animation, too. There, oh, it just took his <laughs> the strongest attack that we've got to do mm -hmm. just under like half a, his health. The, the guy like a third. Yeah, you, you might want to heal up though. here. Yeah. Okay, still got our boys at like less than half. I did, I'm hoping they we don't need to be topped out for all these normal fights around here, but yikes. I think it's really just those hollows that are real bad. Because like these guys, we've been fighting all this whole time. All right, but if we uh, fight more hollows, I, I, these may be pallet swaps of the guys we fought before. And even if they are, they still suck. I guess they're, they're griefs instead of whatever they are. They're going to be grieving themselves after facing us. They're griefs instead of gripes or groans or... Yeah, see what I'm talking about? It's just the, the, mm -hmm. that one group. Well, yeah, but if we fight two of them in a row, it's nah, tough. If we fight another one of those, I will be going a different direction. That group is such an annoying fight. One direction went the other direction. Okay. <laughs> see what I mean? I see this would be easy. It's only three of them, but they don't have those two bird guys backing them up. No problem. Ooh, there's a little, like, up wise hill thing. I gotta get this treasure. Attack by surprise. Surprise. Jerks. Surprise, I'm going to bother to fight you. Oh, gross splash noises when you beat those guys. Yuck. Yeah. Oh. 
All right, what are these guys called? They're moans, I guess. The Greaves and the moans hang out. I mean, it kind of makes sense. I guess that makes sense, yeah. Moaning. Next, we're going to fight Gnashing of, uh, Gnashing of Teeth. Yeah. Moaning, Mer uh, Moaning Myrtle is the uh, the souped-up boss form of those guys. She just hangs around in a, uh, in a uh, we found a tries to see Harry's ding-dong. <laughs> we found a m -m -m mega herb. When the battle was over, the demonic invaders withdrew. But some were left behind. Time those demons turned to humans to reproduce. We were the bad guys the whole time. Giving rise to grotesque and bizarre clans. No, oh never. boy. <laughs> it's getting ra it's getting weird and racial. Like, yeah, it turns out that uh, you know, uh, Lithuanians are the spawn of demons. Hey, they, they seem to apply it was all humans were like that. Wow. Well, <laughs> well, no, because they, they bred with humans, presumably some of them. They said weird tribes. And these, a legend was passed down of a king of hell. One who would lead them to a golden age beyond imagining. Maybe by the time we get to the end of this uh, maze, it will turn out that uh, we were the demons the whole time, but we can transform into true humans and uh, inherit the earth. I feel like I, you're, well, hey, you're skipping my dialogue, Oops. buddy. <laughs> um. Well, yeah, like I, I guess that's a reference to aliens versus demons. I didn't end up finishing that story. Sorry. <laughs> uh, last uh, I don't. I don't think it means Mizuki. There must be plenty of monsters who'd love the top spot, right? I wonder if they're also out to. T they're also out to take Mizuki out. Hey, do you suppose we could introduce some mechanic where at different times of day we're at different party? Or never mind, <laughs> that wouldn't make sense. That'd be pretty funny. I guess it would. <laughs> You're lost, are you? Greetings from hell itself. <laughs> Say greetings to me in hell. This will be your grace. I... Wait, why is he trying to crack it? Let quickly. Why does he even want to murder us? Probably because we didn't we kill him all of last night. I guess we did. I'll carve my name. I like the idea that he recognizes us. Oh, shit. Has you killed me before? Get out of me, Gainan! Into your souls! You are lucky. To be killed by the future king of hell! It is pretty sweet. Hey, don't you dare ignore me! Oh, this is the joke where you can't be bothered with him. Now you've really pissed me off. He's my mouth. He talks too similar to Genjiro. That's the problem. We have a goopy voice for Genjiro, but then Ganon like bleeds into it. I will assist you. Anyone who claim the title of King of Hell must face me. No mercy for those who would serve the darkness. I'm the King of Hell. Oh, hello, darkness. Oh, your old friend. Hanzo, as you may recall, is the father of the, guy, of the kid whose spirit was, whose body was given to be the vessel of Amakusa in the first act. But um, I guess unless you're playing as a. Oh, He's fast. Whiff on that. Unless you're playing as Galford, who is a student of Hanzo's, you, I guess you never find out what happened with that whole situation. <laughs> Good thing we just picked one of those up. And yeah, I was wondering if you can buy those, because that's pretty great. That's pretty great. He's pretty great. He's pretty fucking powerful. Yeah. Oh, nice. He's, he's way better than the guy we picked up. No, we got this covered now. You saw how powerful he was there with that three hit points damage he did. Imperial Void Strike him. or whatever. I don't think that's going to work. I was going to say, if he could not use his most powerful attack every single time, it would be nice. Oops. That's the last time we saved here. I mean, we just loaded the slave state at the beginning of the... At the beginning of the video, I got you. He may be weak against light because he's a demon guy. Or maybe he just gets a bunch of really powerful attacks off at the beginning and then calms down. He's getting a lot of turns. She's dead now. I almost don't want this guy in our party because he eats up a turn and then gives... Mm -hmm. No, I guess he doesn't give them another turn. Okay. 
We can just buy these. We just don't normally use them. I mean, it's a, it's like a full heal, so that's pretty damn good. If you can buy sorcery kits, then I don't mind so much. Like, if you can't, and we're, like, going to be against the final boss with nothing because we blew them all against Ganon, I'll be a, a little more worried. Ooh, he's, he's glowing with power, though, so he's really going to fuck shit up now, if he can connect. Here we go. 60 oh, damage, 60 nice. damage. All right, now we're talking. Can you, like, reduce his defense or some shit? Alright, connecting with attacks does help. Yeah, of that... course. Oh. He's got a full pal meter and he does that attack. He's pretty much going to just uh, instantly take everyone out. Well, we have wizard kits too. Wizard kits are the weaker uh, res item. How come? Oh, he's still glow? If he's missing so much, he should be losing his glow. There we go. Look, we're all missing now. Wizard kit? Or. Well, I'm just. Green. This guy's almost powered up, so I kind of want him to. I guess he has to get hit to power up. I have to press right. the button if I want him to charge manually. Five extra damage. That's gonna make the difference. No, but no, you gotta you gotta think cumulatively. He's done like what, five. He did like three in the last turn. Two. He's done about ten damage if you like really count all of them. <laughs> he did have the one super attack that did like sixty. That has yet to connect. It's that meat grinder slash. Yeah, man, it's crazy. Which is based, I mean, in fairness, it's based on, like, his weapon breaker. His ultimate attack in the game is, looks like that, so. Wow. Ow. That was quite a storm of poison. Mm-hmm. Way to go. Yeah, it's going to be even harder to hit the guy that's never targeted. No, it's, uh, do you know what? I have like uh That's what I'm saying. Do some do some status shit on him. Shocking. Stop doing that. Well you gotta take a speed down or something. Does it give him fewer attacks or, or worse evade? I think worse evade. Better though. I really hope it turns out we can buy sorcery kits, because otherwise we're kind of boned. We've, we've blown everything we've got on this guy. Yeah, that's been char that turn charging up our worst character may not have been enough. Oh, here you go, 274. Meat Grinder Slash. Oh, it's a stat. Oh, we got the back row this time. Is he doing a counter because of that, or is he just getting lots of turns? I don't know. That, that attack is a lot better than what he was doing before, though. It's all powered up. And now again, Gon is powered up, too. Homer was just a distraction. So the true victory could be... I, I really want to see Hanzo win this fight now. After we we talked a bunch of smack, I wanted to finish it. He's wasting his turn! That's, that's not going to do it, though. He's got, he's, he, he has a wife that he yells her name sadly when he dies. Even though when he's not sadly yelling his wife's name, he's talking about how he's going to be the demon king of hell and murder you. <laughs> so it's like at the last minute, they want to be sympathetic. No, he just wants to be a good provider. I want to be demon king of hell just for my wife. Please don't fail me now. <laughs> The aura of hell searches for. Be prepared. I have other matters to which I must attend. I can't hang around with you losers all day. 
Later. I really am anxious to see if we can buy more sorcery kits, though. Because if so, I'm kind of not worried about anything for the rest of the game. <laughs> not a chance. Hee <laughs> hee. I will die before I become the king of hell. It's not just that. It's just not happening today. For now, I return to my home. See, we should have used the kill him attack at the end. Downtown Hades. Ugh. Hmm. There's just some optional boss down here that's going to drop like an item. Ooh, who are these guys? Couldn't get away. I don't think we fought them before. I don't know, he's locked on. These are like those boring ass zombies from Metal Gear Survive. We got like weird heads. You know, like those zombies with weird <laughs> heads. Yeah, everyone knows what I'm talking about, right? It's just like two damage. Yeah, like, what's the deal? It's like 20 minutes of posing, and then it's like, oh, Hansa does more damage than that. What the hell? Look at that hollow and only two hits. What if we had that? What if these guys teamed? These guys are ghouls, right? What if they teamed up with an enemy called ghosts? Huh? Ghosts and ghouls? Ghosts and ghouls, <laughs> exactly. Like the famous video game. Yeah, these guys are so weak we can rrrr them to death. Death by Oh man, even that guy can finish him off. The guy who just defeated Ganon. <laughs> hey, Homer leveled up. He's a master. New move, new move? Antidote. No, antidote. Yeah, his new move is called Antidote. And it is <laughs> taking an antidote out of your pack. Loot over there. But it's a trick trap. No, I'm wondering, is there like an optional boss down here we didn't fight that will drop some item we need to progress in the story? Because they pulled that shit on us before. From what I understand, mm -hmm. they they didn't really do that before. The optional boss turned out not to be an optional boss, but in a different way. It was yeah. like, um, we just took the, the path less traveled. So we ended up in Paris first. You had to pass by that boss to get to Paris. Oh, okay. But if you had to pass by that boss to get to Paris... Then it wasn't optional. But that also means how is it the path less traveled if you have to hit that point before it you get to the It was less traveled point? at the time because uh, people hadn't gone to Paris yet. They were supposed to go to China. Oh, okay. So there's no way to get to that fight where that item saved our life and lose because we didn't have that item. No. Because that would have felt like some bullshit. Because like, how do we always, we always automatically lose after we won that big long boss fight. What the <laughs> hell? And then you find out that yeah that would not have been particularly satisfying design but in fact that was not the design so it's fine and you'll and you'll know when gg satisfied oh yeah you hear that like loud splat sound anyway that wasn't me being satisfied that was me being annoyed by the encounter rate There you go. We're saving some healing items now. I mean, we used like 800 sorcery kits, but we saved a salve there. How dare one of them dodge it? What? Where are we going next? We're going to San Francisco, right? I believe so. San Francisco's got to sell sorcery kits in their stores. I mean, I you think about sense. magic. Yeah, you think about San Francisco. Can see magic. Hey, two of them are confused. Beat up the other ones. Well, he got so confused he used an ineffective attack. Speaking of ineffective ah. attacks. Mm hmm. Oh, he was in the back row. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, he's not confused oh, now. He got unconfused. It's like, wow, one of my it's friends attacked me. Have... I understand what's happening now. The enemies actually have unique. Um... Yeah, confusion, uh, confusion animations and stuff. Well, they still know how to get out of the way of an attack. He's not that confused. Regular attack. Oh. 
Chopped him in half with some earthquake damage. All right. I got some salve. Now we, we gained net salve on that fight. Hey. God, let's demon to San Francisco. And you go to San Francisco. Wear a flower in your hair, however it goes. I don't know. Surprised by attack. Ah, oh, these little fools. Oh, they're slightly yeah. stronger versions. Oh my god, look at that. What are they, like little clown tiger faces? I think Why are like you splitting the damage? Why are you heads. finishing one off? Wait, wait, wait. I get all three attacks at first. Oh. I'm doing the math, man. I might have over... I might have been a little too panicked about that battle. <laughs> It's got to be oh, something yeah. up here, or else why would they have Man. stairs? I, the encounter rate is preventing me from enjoying this the awesome soundtrack of this cave level. Oh, it's the shadow. It's kind of a, oh, wow. You know what? What I would like to see is a uh, SNES era fighting game based around this uh, intellectual property. <laughs> Perhaps with uh, really good graphics and good sound and terrible gameplay. These are apparently the spirits of Bison that have come back. Yeah, like, I, I have not been paying too much attention to the newest Street Fighter game, but even I am aware of the, the bison controversy of homeless bison. <laughs> <laughs> well, I saw, I actually, uh, for whatever reason, was tempted into watching the bison all-story scenes, and I was like, oh, I was kind of hoping, when I heard about this, I was kind of hoping it was, like, amnesic bison, uh, starts being a good guy and then they tease that when he gets his memory back he'll become evil again but like what if bison was a good guy because he doesn't remember that he's a jerk <laughs> hey she also acquired an antidote what if bison suddenly remembers that he's actually vega Oop. treasure how did that work M by uh they so... switched the names from uh japan to north america I, well i know that yeah but but so Balrog in uh, the West is M. Bison in Japan because it's supposed to be like Mike Tyson. Yeah. And then the guy that we know as M. Bison was named Vega. So does that mean that the guy who was known as uh, Balrog to us, he was, so the Balrog that we know is M. Bison and uh, the the guy we know as M. Bison was Vega. So I guess that means that the guy we know as Vega was Balrog? I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I'm not sure how that, that works. I'd be, I'm I'm positive that M. Bison was the fake Mike Tyson in Japan. Yes. And they didn't change it. Like, in his player two color, like in Champion Edition, where they first allowed you to do mare matches, it was called Mr. Dream. And he was Caucasian. <laughs> Did you, uh, did you hear about how uh, E Honda has a name now? <laughs> the E stands for something now? It's Edmund. It's, he's it's always Edmund, been Edmund yeah. Honda. Yeah, like I think he's been Edmund Honda. Well, he's been uh, Edmund Honda the whole time, but they didn't reveal it until uh, a more modern game. I'm almost positive it was in like the fucking, if not the manual, like I think game, so uh, not game facts, uh, there was no such thing. Uh, oh, Game Pro. Uh, which was the one that had their own like, like they they had a lot of stuff where they would fill out their their page count with like big colorful cartoon drawings uh, of characters that were not official art, just their own drawings. Yep. Uh, I'm pretty sure they they named him Edmund because they 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 turned Street Fighter Two for the SNES into like five or six editions of their magazine. It was like next month we'll cover these two characters in depth. Well, it definitely wasn't in uh, in universe until uh, a more modern time. All right, if you say so. Um, I looked it up recently. No, no, I just no, can't remember I, I, exactly what game it was, but it was like uh, in the modern Street Fighter era that they. If you say so, Zephyr Fall, because that's what Zephyr Fall actually stands for. It's, I'm, I'm revealing the true name. How dare you! Now they that know what all this is, 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 is before Zephyr falls stand for. Zephyr, Zephyr, Zephyr fall. 
I was trying to think of an actual name that starts with Z, and I'm like, I can't think of a name that starts with Z. Like, nobody's actually... Or Z, excuse me. Zed, Xavier, Zed, but Zed. spelt wrong. <laughs> what do they call X's there in the Commonwealth? <laughs> Exeters? <laughs> well, that's what we call people from Exeter. Exeters. Okay. Yeah, all the letters have different names. You know that in the Commonwealth they call elves Lisboners? <laughs> he died. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, was he poisoned or something? I don't know what happened. What? <laughs> I was kind of just died. biding my time I... until I could take my turn. and <laughs> He bit down my... and died from the shame of it. I think my Lisboner joke killed him. He's like, <laughs> I don't want to live in a world where that's considered humor. <laughs> Don't worry, little E guy. Nobody, oh, nobody man, else gets that joke either. She is pretty low. Oh, never mind. I, I wasn't, I wasn't looking at the right number. I thought she was like really low on SP. I think it was just showing you how many SP each thing costs, yeah. and it dies after it misses an attack. Because it's like, how could I be less ashamed than my colleague was? So here's the thing that bothers me about this: when there's three yeah. of us and three of them. Each person takes a turn on the team, back and forth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But when there's like three of us and one of them, that one's just like, well, I'm just gonna have to triple time it now. I mean, how else could it be possibly be fair? I mean, so I guess there is no point in killing off. Like, if you have a boss fight where it's like a boss and two minions, there is no point in finishing off the. Minions. Oh yeah, if those minions are weaker than the boss, you might as well just keep them around because they're mm -hmm. just gonna eat up turns. All right, we don't Any want to deal with you guys anymore. Couldn't get away. Death sentence. I guess they have an attack where they do a big damage and then it kills them, but their big damage sucks. Yeah, they do a. It's they have an attack where they do a medium damage. I'm sure it was big damage when they were first introduced, but they've been showing up in every single one of these games. Yeah. Well, it's not even like they like they, it's like a suicide explosion attack. They just come up, she would touch you, and then die. Like, which would be spooky if it was like, if it was some kind of attack where they die, but you always die no matter how many hit points they have. It would be like creepy and spooky and altogether ooky. Yes, it is. It's just like these guys suck. Yep. Bring on the headless guys that take forever to kill and do a billion damage. We want more of that. Hey, at least those I thought that other attack just did this much damage. Couldn't get away. Get us out of here. I don't he's want like this the treasure, thief. but we have to go get it. He's Goodness. like the thief in Final Fantasy who, except that, you know, he's supposed to make it easier to run, but it's not coded right. Yep. <laughs> How come these griefs get all their attack? Like, they didn't surprise us. Why are you getting like, so many okay, attacks? You, you, you keep changing your mind about how the uh, turns work, and no matter what you think is happening, you always think it's bullshit. It's just good sake. It is. They only they have bullshit and worse bullshit is what's going on. Seven degrees of bullshit. Attack by surprise. These guys are gonna die. I don't understand. You're like, I gotta run. I gotta run. I gotta run. Oh, here's one where I'm guaranteed free ability to run. We're gonna fight. Well, because I'm going to get the experience and I can maybe level up. And you then would I get the ran. experience. I pushed, I pushed the button too far. <laughs> oh my God. This is like off screen when I was making fun of you for a typo and then committed a typo in my... I heard you <laughs> like typos, so I put a typo on your typo. Typo personalities. So are we going to get to like the edge of the screen and then call it a video? Because Yeah, uh, we are. But I'm like, for a minute I'm, now. I'm yeah. hoping to do that. We got like a minute to get there. No, I got you. So I'm frustrated. I um, I think overall this is, this is a, like like I've said before, like I was so enamored with this IP. Back on us playing the arcade game, I would have loved this if I could have played it at the time. Now in the cold light of day, this is kind of like not a great game. But I think if you took these fucking boring ass cave sequences out and put more of the oh, there's a treasure we missed. I like the, there the, the non cave stuff is actually kind of fun, but the cave stuff is just brutal. We're at the Demon Gate for San Francisco. So you know what this means. And we can call it a video. 
means we can call it a video and when we come back next time we might be able to get some demonic rice aroni that's right <laughs> what a treat <laughs> it's the demonic treat see you next time folks bye